Want to learn more about the Start by Light features? Let's start by selecting Start by Light in the setup. Once selected, the shown dialog box will pop up providing a list of options in a drop-down menu, Distance, Impact and Traffic Light Countdown. You will notice that the Start by Light default setting is disabled. This can be changed at any time prior to executing a sequence or program. Let's take a closer look at the three options. Distance Start by Light provides four different settings options. Hold and Release allows for the user to hold an object, hand, foot, ball, etc. on the fit light, starting the sequence or program when removed. Near allows the user to begin the sequence or program 10 cm from the fit light. Medium allows the user to begin the sequence or program 30 to 40 cm from the fit light. Far allows the user to begin the sequence or program 80 cm from the fit light. You also have two options for the LED modes, which are standard, solid light with no flashing, and slow flash, which is an intermittent flash. Next, we have the impact start by light. This allows the user to control the start of a sequence or program based on the strength of the impact on the fit light. The impact intensity is based on a scale from one to 10, with one being the lowest and 10 being the highest. For instance, if the impact sensitivity is set at 10, you will need a great deal of force in order to deactivate or turn off the fit light. Finally, we have the traffic light countdown start by light. This allows for a time countdown to start a sequence or program. The fit lights will change from red to yellow to green and then begin the desired sequence or program. For more info, please visit the manual available in the customer portal.